Hi everyone, welcome to another edition of Spring Ford's Cheerleader of the Week. This is sponsored by the Main Street Cafe in Borisford, and today I have Julia Williamson with us. So, we have some pretty talented cheerleaders on our cheer team, including yourself. Have you ever done any gymnastics to help you improve your skills? I've been doing gymnastics since I was about three, and I've continued it ever since. So yes, I've done a lot of gymnastics. <laughs> That's awesome. What kind of suggestions would you have to aspiring cheerleaders? I would say that you want to start as early as possible because like, the more experience you have, the better you get. And it's not just something that comes naturally to a lot of people, so you really have to dedicate yourself to it. I feel like there's a stigma that it's so easy, but obviously you can tell everyone that it's really not. It's a lot of work. Yeah. What are a few of the coolest tricks that you can do? Um, one trick that I can do that's pretty cool is a full. You do a backflip and you twist at the same time, and I've been working on that for a really long time. So obviously something that doesn't happen overnight. Yeah. Is it hard to transition between cheering at a game and doing a full routine at like a pep rally or a competition? Yeah, cheering at a game is more relaxed and like not as physically demanding, but doing a routine is really hard because it's everything pretty much that you could possibly do within two and a half minutes. Is it hard to get everyone to do the same exact thing on a routine? Yeah, practicing for a routine takes a lot more time than practicing like chants and cheers for a game. Interesting. What's the biggest crowd that you've ever cheered for and how does that affect how you cheer and how you perform? So the biggest crowd that I've ever cheered for at a game is probably at homecoming every year. There's like a really big crowd. But when I compete, the biggest crowd that I've ever cheered for is at um, NCAA Nationals in Dallas because that's the biggest competition pretty much in the world. Wow, that's crazy. And that wasn't with school, that was with your other team? Right. That you've been on for forever? Yeah. Wow, that's crazy. I don't think I could ever do that. So thank you for watching the Cheerleader of the Week, and I'll see you next week. Bye, guys.